Hello everyone and welcome to day 46 of how to sell the TV show or die trying. Nancy has been tooling around on the internet mm -hmm. and there are other shows similar to ours, but they say how to pitch a TV show. Yeah, which I'm now wondering if we'd get more hits that way. But pitching is just a part of it. It's selling that's important. Yeah. Anyway, uh, we thought today, now as you most of you may know, tomorrow, big day for us. Mm -hmm. It's our final pre-pitch Mm -hmm. meeting with all of the entities involved on our A project. And there are one, two, three, four, five different entities involved. They're all getting together in a conference room and we're going to... Mm -hmm. Getting our cards together yeah, today. Yeah, so, so we've got to get all of our... We're going to rehearse our pitch. Mm -hmm. But what we thought we would focus on is during this time, this is kind of the quiet before the storm. Mm. And we have stuff to do and we've been keeping ourselves busy, but... This is where you, when you're working with a partner, maybe the little idiosyncrasies that they have yeah, get on your nerves a little bit. Or not get on your nerves, but you, they, they surface. They, they come up. They, they, they surface. Yes. I, I just said it. Wow. Is that... Yeah. I mean, why are you correcting me all the time? <laughs> <laughs> what, do you want to get it out now? I mean, like, what exactly okay, is it? Because well, it to me, it's clear you brought the topic up. Well, there aren't a lot of things that Nancy does that bother me, to be honest. And people are shocked. They're like, God, you guys spend so much time mm -hmm, together. Mm -hmm. You're not sleeping together. You that's that's the reason why we get along so well. If we, we were sleeping together, together it don't would be a nightmare. Don't fuck your writing partner. Right. Don't shit where you try to sell a TV show. Yeah. Uh, but Nancy does this one thing that made it remind made us do this topic. <laughs> That's that right, is, I forgot. When she's reading, <laughs> she'll read out loud kind of a little bit when I'm around because she's kind of if, reading. Or if I'm know, reading to you. I was reading to you, yeah, remember? She'll kind of go, how to sell a TV show, day 40. <laughs> <laughs> she'll inhale while she's reading. So she'll say. It's not uh, very like, Julia to me. I'll do it. To read. I'll do it. Okay. So it'd be like. Um, how to sell a TV show, day 41, Nancy Howard and John Lear. Have you done the thing? So she's inhaling while she keeps reading. And the thing that bothers me about it yeah. isn't, so, I mean, it's It panics you. It, it freaks panics you me. out. I think that there's something wrong with Nancy I, and weirdly, every single time. I, oh, I don't do it in any other walk of life. Like, <laughs> it's like I can't take a breath, so I'll just read. <laughs> <laughs> and she'll inhale while she's reading. And it's freaking uh, dinky, man. I know, it's, it's weird. Kinda, it just makes my heart... Is it's, she all right? Is she having weird. a stroke? And I would never have known I did it if you hadn't brought it up. <laughs> How to sell a TV Okay, show all right. <laughs> I can't even do it. The worst thing is when your partner points it out, it's almost like you go into a freeze mode because you're like, I don't want to do that anymore. It's horrible that I do that. And yet... I you can't, can't do it. I can't do it. But it's good to get it out. But what is mine? What do you think is mine? Well, we used to have a problem when we had that desk across from each other. Yes. And you used to put your bare feet yes. in my face every yes. fucking day. I wear flip-flops. Mm -hmm. I either I wear two. But you used to take them off. And I take my flip-flops off. Yeah. And then I like to write. When we're writing, I like to put my feet up. I'm yeah. So it would today. be like, and I'm, my... I'm, uh, this is how I'm working. <laughs> like that. And then I'd that be like. horrible. And I'd go. John, can you please put your feet and down? And I would immediately go, oh, I'm sorry. Yeah. Because I didn't realize I was doing it. Yeah. But I have oh, horrible God, feet, too. Oh, God, that used too. to drive me nuts. If you go back to, I believe it's day one or two of this vlog, we feet. talk about the Lear feet because yeah. our my second toe, not the big toe, but the one next to it, is always longer than the big toe. And mm. all Lears have this genetic defect. Yeah. Uh, so I have ugly feet. I mean, I'm we, sorry. Look, there are other things that bother me, but I that's number one. I go to the bathroom a lot. You do do that. I go to the bathroom a lot. I have issues. I have some anal But issues. I do too. I have the same thing. What? Hemorrhoids? Oh, I didn't know that's what you were talking about. I had a bout of hemorrhoids, and if anybody's out there... But that doesn't bother me. Oh, it's horrible. It's such an old man thing. But it's, it's gone. They're gone now, but I have to go to the bath. I had to go to the bathroom a lot because oh. you got to keep it... Right. Okay. Now we're getting too personal of. with the outside. If anybody knows any good home remedies for him, I don't have them though. Now they've they've gone away. Well, all of our problems are about to go away because we're about to sell a TV show tomorrow. We, yeah, tomorrow's big big day. So we will report before and after the meeting. And everyone who's watching, please write down the idi idiosyncrasies of your partner, whether they be real. Or, you know, and maybe, how about this? The person who writes the idiosyncrasy that bothers the two of us the most, 
We'll get a prize. We'll steal something from the uh, from CAA s- meeting. One, yes. We'll, a pad of paper. They have CAA yes. pads of paper. We'll steal one. So whoever has the best idiosyncrasy will get a prize. That's Thank all you. for today. <laughs>